But it was, uh, I don't know how it happened. Uh, but yes, I'm broke. Walk me through this. You have no real responsibilities. You are the youngest. Your contribution to mom's okay is the least. Rent and bills, that's about it. So, so again. That's just the situation that I find myself in. Mm, well, that's too bad. That's too bad. What does that mean? It means that I have a lot going on. For instance, I'm getting married soon, as you well know. Yes, that Russian woman. Her name is Anastasia. Like I said, I'm here to understand how you of all people can get yourself in such a fix. Unless you are telling me you invested the money. Did you? No. So you work. Your pay is pretty awesome. You have no kids. Okay, I I, I get it. Brother Ifosa, you, you don't have the money to give me. It's fine. No, 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 no. You don't get the point. But really, how do you really manage to spend all you earn? You have to learn to live within your means. for sending in the documents. It has already proven to be so helpful. You're welcome, Ms. Kubadia. But you know, you could have easily printed your bank statement via First Online, the first bank online backing platform, yeah? Oh, Peggy, those things are so difficult to navigate. Nope, not ours. In fact, you can view your most recent transactions from First Mobile, our mobile banking app, or through WhatsApp banking platform. I'm sure once you get hooked on these platforms, you will delete my number and you will never need me again. Most people don't know where the money they earn goes. Thank you. What percentage of your income goes towards food, transportation, or clothes? Just like in any successful business, where you track your revenue and costs, it is important to track the expenses in our personal lives. African women need to become the CFOs of their financial lives and take control of the income that they earn now instead of waiting for their incomes to increase in the future before they learn to manage their money. 150,000 Naira just on Ashway B in the past three months. Now I understand where all my money is going into. Yes, Jay. Please open your mouth. Yes, Jay, you have to eat. You know you didn't eat last night. Hmm? You won't be strong, okay? One for mommy. Hey, guys. Oh, so Where's my little you? man? Daddy, where were you? <laughs> I was working. Will you have me to my homework? Um, yeah, sure. But uh, why don't we let mommy do that for you? Okay, she's really fast. Huh? He has a play date today, so he has to go take a bath. Olivia. Olivia. Yes, madam. Can I come have SJ's bath for him so I can drop him at his friend's house on my way out? Yes, he. Oh. Sweetheart, we'll all play tomorrow. Off Daddy, you go. Go take your bath. Oh. Where have you been? I don't understand. All night. I called you, I left you messages, I even waited up for you. And you're just getting back. No, I just want you know that when I go out chasing a deal, I usually stay till it's done. I know, but it's not fair to leave SJ and I alone all night. The boy is starting to ask questions. You know, I knew it. With all the, the questions he was asking and, you know, um, where was I? I should help him with his homework. I know you put him up to it. How can you say that? The boy is growing really fast and he's starting to notice things. I, I mean, I can't help that. I, I had to chase a deal that took me all the way to Ikodo and then all the way back to Shongo Tedo. That's a lot. Look, I know you work so hard, but you still have to make an effort, eh? So we don't set a bad example. But this, oh God, would you just please stop bugging? Am I not doing all of this stuff so that we can have a comfortable life? So I know and I understand. Do you really? It looks like when I go out and I'm chasing money, you prefer that I'd rather you stay here and depend on you so that you can lord it over me. But that's not fair. In all the time we've been married, I never bring it up that I'm the one bringing in the money. 
Because I believe my money is our money. Okay, so why bring it up now? Why bring it up now? Look, I see through all this, this, this your act. I see through it. I, I, it, it doesn't fool me because I know that you are very resentful and that's why I will continue to try. So if it means that I stay out all night, so be it. Don't call me. Don't be worried. Soja, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Ah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to make you upset. Hmm? Calm down. I'm sorry. Okay, but you too. Why are you now leaving emojis on that China's as Instagram? Huh? Are you? Are you? Are you kidding? So you are married now, and people notice these things. Even my friends are starting to ask. Your friends. <laughs> Your friends, look at this one. If you don't want me to go anywhere, I, I or you don't want me to have any friends, you better say that now, so that I will know that I'm in prison now. I didn't say that. No, because marriage to you is is a place where you have no friends and you can go nowhere. What's going on, mommy? Um, good morning, ma. Did, did we wake you up? Why won't you wake me up? Eh? When you are shouting at my son in his own house so that the whole neighborhood can hear. How won't you wake me up? Mommy, I'm sorry. I didn't know we were disturbing you. I was just asking Soji here why he was. Why what? <laughs> Instead of you to think of how to relax your body so that it can produce a second grandchild for me. You are here fighting and shouting at him every single time. Uh-uh. Uma uh -huh. I'm, I'm sorry, mom. Sorry for yourself. See, I know what is your problem. You don't want my son to go out and progress at. You want him to be here, empty-handed, so that you can continue to control him with your money. But you know what? You have failed. Oh, she? Mommy, it's okay. I can't. So, what call me? Me, I just came to say my own. No. Fire well, sorrow. Handle your wife, oh. Ah, mommy, you're okay. okay. So, you're okay. Mm -hmm. Eh? Um, actually, more okay. I'm, um, I'm, I'm actually going to go out again. Yeah. Yes. Uh, some guys called me to talk about a brief that I had submitted in, earlier in the week. So, I mean, I just came back so that I could tell uh, Adiswa that uh, I'm going to spend the whole day out today again. <laughs> So you are taking permission from your wife to go out. <laughs> hey, Soji, you are the man of the house. Shebo shewe. Do you hear me? Do as you like. Ashimo. Tori kori le gbeni. What? She's my mom. What am I supposed to tell her? My, my guys Service charge. <laughs> Madam, Madam Suri, stay inside. Now pack it. Thanks for agreeing to be our guest today, 2019. 46,000. <laughs> hey, 
mami. You good? Need a ride? No. I've lost track of time. Dealing with my financials. Say what now? I've been trying to figure out where all my money has been going, and girl, I'm in shock. I don't understand. Okay, well, after what Lara said about me being a liability and not planning correctly, and then tons of questions from my brother, I decided to figure out where all my money has been going to. And my dear, again, I'm in shock. How shocking you? <laughs> the things that I've been spending my money on. <laughs> now, if you want to have a heart attack, try figuring out where all your money has been going to. <laughs> my dear, I'm in shock, which is the reason why I'm even calling. Do we know anyone who's getting married soon? You mean apart from Olumi? <laughs> Very funny. Yeah, sorry, sorry, too soon. But in this Lagos, uh -uh. somebody's always getting married now. Fair enough, but I don't know who I indicated interest for Ashwin B. Because I just got an Ashwin B and the card reads T Day 2019. Oh, and Tina now. Tina and DG today. Who is Tina? Zuri, my sister's classmate I introduced you to. The day we met at Seka before you traveled now. Are you joking? Why? I don't even know this girl. What's my business with her, Ash, baby? <laughs> okay, calm down. It's not that serious. Ash, baby, we all went to school together. We're all friends. Even if you don't really remember her. Exactly. Which is why I'm trying to figure out why she even invited me to her wedding in the first place. Now offering me Ash, baby, and... How did she even get my address? Well, uh, okay, fine. See, she asked me to be on her battle trainer. Hey, I know I'm going alone, so why not invite my besties? You don't even know this girl. Why did you even agree? She was looking for her girls to be on her train. And I no mind. Azuri, if you see the caliber of their groomsmen, oh, see, she don't ask me. I will love you. Okay, my friend. I know that you are the most when it comes to being a social butterfly, but. Don't you think this is a stretch? Oh, that one is a business. See, why are you even complaining yourself? Is that thing on like 40k? 46,000. Mm -hmm. Part of broke, don't you understand? Being broke is a temporary condition. Now, becoming a social pariah, that's permanent. But look at that fabric now, Zuri. Uh -uh. I think the girl even subsidized itself. Well, nevertheless, I don't need another Ashway B. I'm returning it. Eh? Zuri, don't try it. Do you want to train in Lagos again? And for the wrong reason, yet again? That's not fair now. I'm yeah, sorry, but see, please don't come and disgrace me. <laughs> see, you even complaining. My own bridesmaid bill is like 250k. From hair, meal, shoes, matching jewelry, even contribution for like three showers. <laughs> mm. Well, good luck with that. Oh, I need it all. I can't even come and complain too much before they say I'm a single spring with bad belly. Oh, babe, let me focus on this, my makeup. I've been just shopping this poor girl. Who is doing your own? Me, myself, and I. Remember, I'm broke. Bye. It's not easy. Yeah, it's cute. I like it. Rubbish, Ashwebi. Unless you're a relative or a close friend. No, Ashwebi, because oh. why? Nothing, no. I'm just not spending my money on unnecessary things. Oh, baby girl, the price of Ashwebi is not even that steep. Please help me tell her. <sighs> it's true, I mean, if it's one every six months. But ladies, we go to a wedding every other weekend. How many 46Ks will I now spend? Mm -hmm. I mean, I guess I'm gonna have a bag. A rich boyfriend will solve this yourself in posting jeans. <laughs> no. Plus, let's not even lie. Mm. Ashwabi guarantees us better service at weddings. Tell her, please. Oh, it is very yeah. true. All right, so I'll solve that. We did this and we'll be good to go. Mark and Bar, please, I need pins. Okay. Yeah. Mm. Please, please, please. No. no. Yes. Yeah, so this can't shine. No. Tell me what's to shine like your that. body. <laughs> yes. 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 Lagos 
I never understand how they spend so much money for us to come and eat and drink for free. Oh, I agree, it's so not worth it. And I am upset about that Ashley B thing. Not to mention people making you travel to go and celebrate with yeah. them. Like, honestly, really. That one is too much. Mm -hmm. I just I don't do that. I don't allow Zuri to convert you, please. Thank Same you. Ah, even though I should probably not be adding too much to this conversation, seeing as what it pays for everything, you know, mm. from holidays to rent, expense, even my own personal upkeep. Mm. Like, Everything, you guys. And I don't even know how much you all add up. Hey. It sounds crazy. Wow, wow. Yeah. that sounds crazy. Well, this is for you that you don't know, Shao. But in my case, <laughs> so G is the sole provider. Um. And we all just, you know, we still share, we plan, and we do everything together in love. Oh, that sounds lovely. Mm -hmm. mm. Is this no so G? Yeah. See. Uh, hmm. yeah. I thought he was supposed to be up and down Lagos trying to get deals. Oh, that was earlier in the week. No, uh -uh. this is Damola's 40th birthday bash. This was yesterday. Was all over social media. Did he mention it? Uh, he said he would pop in there if he finished from work early. Okay, so why didn't you just go with him? I work. I heard that the party was wild, Sha. It was, but. <laughs> I trust my buddy. He will not be doing any wild thing without me. You guys know that I watch her. And I can't be wilding with my husband. Because I have to cut <sighs> And I you love my job. Oh. What's that? What's that? No, nobody. No, no, no. Don't, don't do that. This time. Oh my God. Oh, tell us. Who is who? Who is who? Let's not. Nobody. He's just, he's, 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 he's just a guy that my firm wants to work with, but he's annoying, so it's oh, oh, But he can cute. annoy me anytime. <laughs> but it's cute. But well, cute guys can be annoying, child. I hope he has money. He definitely looks like a dog. Mm. No, he might be a scrub. Uh, oh, you guys. You guys. This is Lagos. Please, I beg, I beg, I buy it on behalf of my friends. Yeah. Um, <laughs> come here. <laughs> no. <laughs> Are you sure? Yeah. Not to be lurking anyway. Yeah. And he might be preaching also, you never have to lament over 40k as you be again. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, shots. That one, one. time time you are that so one. unrelenting with this Ashwebi matter. <laughs> Do you know that a man is not a financial plan? Now you know. See you guys here. Just leave. Oh, you guys, look at me, look at me, look at me. Act natural. Oh my god. So you know that guy? He's now away. So I have to go back. No, 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 I know, I know, but my taxi is coming. Yes. Yeah, so we're all meeting next week. Yeah. Yeah. Mwah. 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 Mwah
Hello? Hey, madam, I know you're for me again. I wanna ask you something. Okay, madam, I hear you. Okay. Um, do you think you can sell my car? As you did. How now? I mean, fix it, sell it, and then you'll get a cut from the sale. Is that something that you can do? Eh, hey, madam, you don't have to do my work, but I know somebody will pay one for you. Yeah, no, that's fine. As long as you trust the person, I'm, I'm fine with that. But do you think that maybe you can possibly get me another car? Something cheaper. You know, something that I can manage for now. Yeah, madam, I'll go help you find around. I'll go help you check. Am I worried? Okay, great. So we'll talk more about it tomorrow, yeah? All right, bye-bye, madam. Okay, thank you. You have finally agreed to open this yard door, huh? Uh, good evening, Mr. Okay. Uh, keep your greeting to yourself. Uh, would you like to come in? No. I am not your visitor. I will stay on your domot. I did not come to sell any market. Why have you not been picking your call? I have been out of the country, so... Jury, hey. Fine guy like you. You want to start your way out. You want to deceive me? I am talking about since you came back. In fact, since that very night that you returned. Oh, wait, have you been monitoring my movements? That is not of importance. What is important is my money. Where is your service charge? Where is your service charge? Yes. I need to settle down and I will pay. Umberu, settle what? That is how you told me before you traveled. When I came to your place, like a normal human being, be a jury, your charge is due. You say, relax. Mr. Okeke, relax. You now pass my back, like Ronaldinho, and travel for over one month. Who did you keep here to pay your service charge? Um, Mr. Okeke, please. I, I just want to know if you can please just lower your voice. And you have no problems. I, I will definitely pay. Yes, you must pay. As far as I'm alive, you must pay. But when is the question be that? I'm not sure exactly, but soon. Mr. Okeke, I, I'm going through a very hard time financially right now. But I promise you, I will bounce back. Okay? Oh, I didn't knew that you are not a basketball. You will bounce back. That one is not concerning me. Whether you bounce or you do frog jump or you cut walk, just to pay me. Pay me my service charge, jury. Hey! This is the problem with all these small, small, lucky girls. This is the problem. Hey! I'm sorry? What are you sorry about? The fact that you are a lucky small girl or that you are still owing me service charge. You see, when you are having a rosy relationship with your sugar daddy, everything sweet, diabetic, you behave yourself. But when small bit of leaf water has entered the relationship and on a quarrel, it is we that come and suffer for it. Don't insult me. Mm. I will pay you. I will not take or tolerate your disrespectful insinuations. Yeah, Jury, is it to me that you are raising voice for and just blowing big, big grammar? You want me to throw you out? Ah, oh, Becky! I'm not going anywhere. Okay? You need to calm down and allow us to speak like adults. I have a decent job. Okay? <coughs> Madam, decent job. 
I didn't knew. Don't be vexed. <laughs> but uh, as I did not go to school, can you kindly explain to me how come you that have a decent job, you are broke? Many women have no idea how much their lifestyle costs. I am here. She may not spend recklessly, but she subconsciously develops a bad habit of spending without intention. If you don't treat the money you earn with respect, it will leave you with no respect. Um, Mr. Tunde wants you in his office. What? It's closing time now. Well, he was asking me something about the Heritage House deal you're working on. Oh, I'll do the report tomorrow, of course. Off already? Uh... You know, I would assume that after a little talk, you would realize without prompting that you should put in even more. I, I, I am, sir. Let me give you some advice. Uh, you mind if I sit down? Uh, uh, <clears throat> as I was saying, let me give you some advice. I see a lot of potential in you, Zulu. But you know, I also see someone who, if allowed, will squander that potential. And I will not allow it. Tell me something, Zuri. Do you feel this job is fitting for you? It, it is. And do you feel that you are fitting for this job? I, I, I hope so. <laughs> I know so. Otherwise, I wouldn't hire you in the first place. Nor will I overlook your many blunders in the past months. Uh. Thank, thank you. Uh, look, I am just one man. Meaning, I have only one vote. And I won't squander that vote on someone who sees her job as nothing but a ticket to an easy life. Uh, I'm sorry, sir. I don't want you to be sorry. All I want you to do is prove to the other partners and to your peers as well, that you aren't here just because of some foreign degree. That's what they are saying, you know. And most importantly, I want to see again that young girl of 26 who, after a few months she started working here two years ago, closed a hundred million naira deal. Do you remember? Not only how proud I was of you, but how proud you were of yourself. So I need you to recapture that moment. Hmm? Yes, sir. Otherwise, you'll be looking for another job. Anyway, do have a good weekend, Miss Gubadia. See you on Monday. I... Mm. I gave you a message when I was shopping for a dress to wear tomorrow. <laughs> You're getting a new dress for tomorrow? Of course, yes. It will not be her that Ladun wants the same dress twice. <laughs> but it's a child's birthday. <sighs> My darling, look, that is where you are wrong, okay? About 60% of people at that party will not be children. I mean, take us for example, are we not going? Yes, but Banka is our friend. <laughs> You will be amazed at how many intimate friends people have in this Lagos. Anyway, it would have even been a good chance to see you guys and hang out, especially since I can't make it this evening. We've just been hanging out less and less 
as a group since Zuri started this her money cleanse. <laughs> money cleanse. I actually love that term. Um, anyways, this is what's going to happen. I will drop the kids off with the nanny. I'll post her a few pictures, hang around for a bit, and I'm off to my massage. Actually, that's what I wanted to talk to you about. I can't come. Wait, say what now? My dear, walk home. Honestly, in fact, I'm still at work right now, and there's no sight of me closing anytime soon. <sighs> Look, I don't understand the shit people's work. I don't get it. I'll forever just be grateful that Buddy married me right after NYC and saved me from all of this one. What's this? Hmm, lucky you. And then I start to wonder, with you who's so averse to anything work, if Bode wasn't doing all these things, what would you do? Hey, no, no, no. I just want to... Don't be asking me jam questions. Please, please, please. Why did you say you called me again? Look, that I'm going to miss the party doesn't mean SJ should miss it too. In fact, he will sulk for a whole month. So I wanted to ask if you could please pick him up and take him with your kids. Of course, of course, my darling. Um, but wait, what of his father? Well, the way I hardly see... So Actually, he's been uh, chasing on some contracts and I can't really argue with that. My love, wait. Hope your mother in law is not around because I can always feel that when that woman is judging me and I don't like it. <laughs> don't worry. She has gone back to the house with her stack. Mm, okay. I will send you pictures of her little munchkins having fun. All right, my love. Thank you. Bye. Hey, mama. <laughs> you look super exhausted. Are you okay? Do you know... Let me wash this off my face so I can smile a little better and I'll get her some wine, okay? Mm. Yes. I'll be right back. Hey, babe. What's good? Mm. Nothing's popping. I can't see straight. Uh, Trudy. My dear, work wants to kill me. Well, hard work is good. So I'm sure that you'll be fine. Mm. What is Ladu? She wants to get wine. <laughs> Mr. Tunde read me the riot act today. Why? What happened? I mean, there is some truth to what he's saying. I could try a little bit harder, I guess. Oh, babe, well, at least you know that you could do better. Mm. And that is the most important first step. So just do better and everything will be fine. <sighs> you look pretty. Thank you. <laughs> so, babe, how far tomorrow now? I hope you're not going for that stupid part. Uh, Lara, come on now. Catch. Okay, I see me. Wait. Tommy is calling me. Let me put her on speaker. Hey. Hey, babe. Hello. Uh-uh, so you for having more council meeting without me. In fact, uh, we are plotting your assassination. <laughs> God forbid, I bind you. Why are you guys now half out tomorrow? Lara, I hope you've changed your mind about not coming for the party. That's exactly why I'm trying to convince Lara of right I now. I have told you people, I have no interest whatsoever in going for this party. Why? Come on now, just come. Um, hey, I always say she do you. <sighs> she's always so smug. And she's always low-key rude to me. Okay, she's very passive-aggressive. In fact, you guys just won't get it. That's normal level now. It's not just that. It's about how she manages to make every conversation about her. She has to fit her perfect life into every little conversation. Like the time that we went to the spa. Can somebody please tell me who asked her about her second honeymoon to marry Mbadibo? Did you ask her? <laughs> Tommy, did you ask? Because, I, I mean, I'm just saying. Okay. We spent the whole day talking about that. Fine. So then why don't you hate Ladun? I mean, all she talks about is, oh, buddy, this and then, oh, buddy, that and, oh, my fabulous life in Ikoi. <laughs> <laughs> my dear Banker doesn't mean any harm. Okay, first of all, Ladu is our baby, okay? Mm -hmm. So how can you even compare the two? Mm -hmm. Second of all, I just don't like her. So she probably invited me so she could show off. You know, I think she's jealous of me. You guys know 
that she dropped out of school, right? Hey. And we're in the same department. And trust me when I say she was an Oludu. Even if I'm married, I helped her ministry. Oh, God. Huh. Lara, I have never heard you speak about someone like this before. Oh, see, I've been looking forward to catching up with you guys, so. What? What? <gasps> it's so pretty. What? You guys, one of my two sisters just sent me another gift. Please ask her. Ah, it's one guy like that too. He met me in front of Seka and that was it. He became obsessed with sending me all sorts of gifts and shit. <laughs> Ooh, this person sounds like a keeper. I know. You don't even know him. <laughs> Sam, Sam. <laughs> okay, as I was saying, I'll go for the party. Because of you guys. Yes. Because of you guys. But I am not buying her little bratty kid a present. See ya. Oh. Yeah, you're coming. I'm so happy. Yo, she can catch these hands if she tries me. Like, I'm not playing. Relax. <laughs> start taking pictures before the crowd descends. Crowd? Yes, yeah, so at least a hundred. You know Nigerians. Some people will come with plus one or plus two. It's a good thing that I'm ready for them. If they like, each person should come with plus five. Where is this makeup artist self? Banke. Banke. What? I thought you said we'll only have a small get together. Yeah, it's small. Hello? Kike, you want to be unfortunate today at me? Oh, you're here? Okay, just wait downstairs. I'm coming now. Sweetheart, what is it? Banke, I'm wondering exactly what in the world is going on out there. You said we're having a small party inside the house, but I wake up to meet my house being turned into a bazaar. Oh, stop it. Do you know what today is? This is the first birthday of your only son. I know what it is. It's only a first birthday party. His name ceremony was big. The dedication even bigger. Which is why we agreed to keep this small, remember? But it's small, by legal standards. How much exactly are we spending on this? But what is it? Is it because of a party of a hundred people that you want to stress my life? Don't let the world heal. Go and start getting ready, please. I can't be dealing with this. Hello? Yeah, please come in. you could make it. Mm. Mm. You're welcome. Thank you. So, you're by yourself? Actually, yes. I'm meeting the girls here. Haven't they arrived? Oh, you just missed Ladu. Oh. You know, she brought a gift and dropped the kids off before rushing off to your wedding. Oh. I but I wasn't talking about the girls. Still no boyfriend? <laughs> Actually, He's just not a party person, especially kiddie parties. Mm. I see. Anybody that I know? Actually, no, I don't think so. I mean, he just came in from out of town. You might have seen him on the Forbes list maybe, but I'm pretty sure that you don't know him personally. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> But this really is lovely. I'm sure the kids are absolutely blown away. I know, right? <laughs> Thank you. You know, 
deep down I knew it's a little OTT but man the pressure and the stress to have my boy I just I just knew that the closer to your age the, oh, you know, the older that I got that the tougher it would be so we're just so blessed that it happened when it did <laughs> okay it's kind of weird seeing as you know you're a year older than me but maybe you forgot because you dropped out of school but anyway I'm so glad that you know everything is going well for you because you know some people's marriages oh, are so fragile uh -huh. there's some women who know that if they're not able to have a male heir then <laughs> who knows they might just <laughs> find themselves without a husband and with no degree oh god and imagine if they had no marketable or bankable skills to rely on how tragic would that be well i i guess i'll never know can't relate sure you can enjoy the party I will. bye <laughs> Hey girl. Hey girl. Huh? Fashion a little late, huh? Who, me? No, I mm. Mm. never fashion me anything. I have nothing on Tammy. Where is she? She's inside for doing what I have now. Yeah? Hi, guys. Mm. Hello, Chinasa. How are you? I'm T. Lara. I'm fine, thank you. It's Lagos. We're all hustling. Huh? <laughs> this your outfit is fabulous. Always oppressing us. Just Lara will do. And thank you. But I cannot call you Lara like that, Auntie. Like on me? No. Aren't you hilarious? So, girl. Mm -hmm. How far? Uh, we're here. So, apparently, Francesca organized a Christmas party. Mm -hmm. It was so nice. Mm -hmm. And she says that she's still chasing her for the balance of her payment. <gasps> no, stop. You're lying. Yes, very beautiful. What's that your name again? Tammy. Tammy Larry Davids, ma'am. Oh, wait. Davids? Yes. As in Kashokwe Davids' <laughs> daughter? Yes, ma'am. Ah, I know your parents. <laughs> Absolutely. Benny, I'm all. So, Tammy. Ma? You said you are a tailor. Uh, they now call it fashion designer. <laughs> I'll be back. Oh, yes, <laughs> thank you. That is the way the carpenters say they are now interior decorators. <laughs> no, no. Is everybody having a good time? Can I get anyone anything? Ah, Banke. Where's my grandson? I've put him upstairs for his nap. He'll be down in 30 minutes. Sleeping at his own party camp. I uh, hope you're not raising my grandson like your daughters. He is a boy. Yes, absolutely. And the heir. Hmm. Mm. Mubanke, please. I won't mind some more. Yes, mommy. Coming right up. Um, where is Abike? Is she not supposed to be here helping out? She had an urgent email to attend to at work, so she had to leave. She's very busy. In fact, her boss can do anything without her. Mm. Mm. She's working hard. She should slow down and settle down. Abby. Abby. But she's a fantastic architect. Mm. She has a great career. Mm. Career without husband and children is baseless. Mm. If it's mm. not happening for you, is it not better to just focus on what is in Are you the first to work? Uh -uh. Ah. We have also worked and managed the home. Oh, yeah, Milena. Even for that girl's daughter, is doing it. She's an engineer with four children oh. and a side business also. Um, is she not the one that remarried? Ah, oh, my shoe. <laughs> mm. To that very handsome man. Yes, yeah, so very handsome. Mm. And also, he spent thrift. <laughs> In case you don't know, mm -hmm. I'm hopefully, I know you know soon, since he's uh, currently engaged to your niece, if I am yeah. not mistaken. Yeah? Mm. Um, would anyone like to see my new designs for Google's? 
Mrs. Bolanli on Sipi tells us I just ordered her one. She loved it so much. She ordered more. Let me see. Really? I you have to see that. This is not going Someone you can marry. Exactly already. Mm. Say it as it is. Adios. I am a Yoruba woman. And in my language, we have ore or oko. Meaning friend or husband. husband. <laughs> what this one you people are putting in between? Eh? Boyfriend, fiance, partner. They are just Time wasters that we don't even recognize. Yes. Yes, I have a nephew who is an accountant. In fact, he works in a chartered accounting firm and he's a very handsome and reserved man. Mm. Mm. In fact, you will like him. I'm going to introduce you to him. Yes. Oh, what responsible. <laughs> Thank you, Ma. Mm. Ma, let, I'm coming. Let me oh, let me go and get that for oh. Okay. Oh, look at you. <laughs> Man, you have seen the slam dunk that I did, bang girl. <laughs> wait, wait, Sammy. Oh, see me here. Oh, hey, girl. Jay, I'm so fat. Yeah. I wonder why I thought sitting in a room filled with old women trying to size you up and marry you off to their sons and nephews was a good idea. <laughs> At least they're trying to marry you off. Mm. You did not have to deal with Banker's stupid, horrible comments. Oh, um, did you come alone? <laughs> well, thank you for taking me out of that place. I was becoming murderous with that crazy talk. What we'll talk? Uh -oh. Short version, Trinasa was championing gossip about Banker, implying that she's broke. I mean, I know she doesn't mean any harm, mm. but, you know, mm -hmm. I think that girl. There's something looking slimy about her. Right? Yeah. Seriously. And that how everybody is my uncle. Sugary, syrupy act that she's always trying to do is definitely not pure. Oh, Uncle Suleiman, we need to see. Oh, Uncle Eric, tell your wife that her recipe is so just divine. Egg boy, egg boy, egg boy. Okay, bitch, we get it, you're too. Yeah, you're too. Oh my god. Okay, look, I'm, I'm not a fan, but she's not that bad. She's 23, right? Uh -huh. Are you kidding me? Did you see how she was maliciously pushing baggage just on that table? <sighs> I mean, seriously, fine. The juice is juicy. This one just... The bitch is broke. Uh, mm -hmm. The bitch is broke. Yes. <clears throat> it matter how satisfying the gist, however, still, still, still. It does not mean that somebody should walk up into her house, eat her food, mm -hmm. drink her drink, and then just casually spread malicious gist about her at her own damn party. Mm -mm. Lagos, 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 Lagos. It scares Lagos. me. Everyone's pretending. I mean, one minute you're sharing an issue that you have, the next you're trending. Ah, please. I don't have time for that. We all look so good, though. Yes, baby. Let's go. Let me make sure Bankers is my new gold earrings. Hush out. Tom. Tom. Where is this place now? Now that they've all gone, you haven't answered the question I asked you earlier. Babe, let's talk about it tomorrow now. No, okay. Now. I just don't understand why you're getting so agitated about this. Banker, would you stop? Please, just, just stop this. Why are you trivializing this? How in the world are we indebted to different vendors to the tune of millions? And then you still went to the bank to get a loan for this party? Yes, I know. The bank manager called me. Why, Banker? Me? So it's all my fault, Abby. It's my fault. Look, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not saying that, but you know what we have on ground. Why did we have to make our son's first birthday a large event? <laughs> See, let me put you on notice. After all the stress that your family put me through to have that son, you better believe that every party he has from now on is going to be epic. Are you out of your mind? <laughs> You do realize that finances are no longer what they used to be. I do want your enemies to know about it, but think about what you're doing. Why are you doing like this in all the Lagos that we're living in? Do you want everybody to know that we're broke? 
Our parties are legendary. If the standards drop, don't you think it will cement what people are thinking about us? Is that what you want? Of course not, mm -hmm, but... Exactly. So let's not play this blame game. Let's figure out how we're going to pay these vendors. And by let's, you mean me, yeah? These debts, they'll call us 